So I've decided going forward, I'm going to open every episode with a top tip for the day. Because, you know, I've got like 7,000 hours. I'm probably probably the foremost expert of RimWorld going. Here's today's top tip. If you've got a prison full of... What the... If you've got a prison... <laughs> size of his head. <laughs> Distension ruining the bit. If you've got a prison full of people, here's an idea. Make sure that you have set them to recruit. Otherwise, you might fall uh, purely hypothetically or purely by example. You might be sat here for like an hour wondering why no one's being recruited, frantically checking the, the, the work tab and making sure that everybody's the right ideology. You have to actually recruit them. I would never make that mistake. No, no, no. Rimble, rimble, rimbies yourself. We are close to the end of our adventures here in End's Empire. My my building experience, because let's be honest, it took a long time for the Empire stuff to get going, and it, a lot of that time beforehand was spent with me hollowing out mountains and caves. But I've got it out of my system now, so we're good for another six or so series before I do the same thing again. I've been doing a little spring cleaning between now and yesterday's episode, where the armies of hell itself decided to descend on the colony and almost kill us. Jesus Christ, give me a minute. My God, man. <laughs> the Toongi Tomboy beatdown. Get him. Get him. That's against game mechanics. You can't both be... You can't both be stood in the same tile. I've done a lot of spring cleaning. I've tried to make things run as smoothly as possible because, again, it is effectively just a countdown to the end of Anne's adventures. At this point, we are slowly stockpiling every single piece of gold on the face of this planet, all the gold we will ever need to just immediately make Anne the brand new High Stellarch. So I ended up taking apart the majority of the drain caskets because they do tend to be a little... When you got, you got like as many as I've got, that's a lot of extra stuff you're throwing at the game and asking it to do. I've already did the work tabs and I've redone like the, the colony bus. Don't worry about it. All a bunch of boring shit so that we can very smoothly get to the finish line because I'll cry if we don't get there now. Now, somebody said in the comments, and I'm not sure this is true, that apparently the mining skill at the camps is actually irrelevant. It's just the amount of pawns that are there. Specializing in collecting stone or metal can it be placed on hills or mountains once an ample amount is collected. I have no idea. Because it doesn't say in the description. Look at the speed. Look at the speed. I can attach these people to... Ah, careful there. Attach these people to caravans. I did not convert them because they are already bloody legion. They already revere blood feeders. We don't have to do anything with it. And some other bullshit that I'm using to justify speeding things up a little bit. Uh, what, you can build walls in front of heaters? Oh, that's new and interesting. Is that a problem? It's not going to, like, burn anything down? Doesn't strike me as, like, maybe the best health and safety standard, I will admit. Is anybody going to allow me to build this or what? Huh. <laughs> Would you look at that? Okay. Well, my bad. I guess it doesn't really matter too much. It's still warm in there, right? Yeah, there's still plenty of heat radiating through that log wall. You'll be fine. It's not like we have an aversion of fire here or anything. Deadlift, I freed from his learning that because I'll be honest, he's already our best crafter, chef, plants expert, and melee character going. He's like amazing. Just like actually amazingly good. So I thought, hey, join us, Deadlift. And Deadlift, I've given the Cat's Fright's armor, officially part of uh, Bo Woman's faction. Hey, here's another piece of advice. You can have two in one day because I'm feeling generous. If you've got a prison full of people who consume Hemogen, make sure you stop them consuming Hemogen. Otherwise, you'll never convert them. You'll just be there for, or recruit them, I suppose, reduce resistance. Otherwise, you'll just be there for hours feeding them Hemogen without any progress. Yeah, here's another piece of advice. The third piece, don't take 50 fucking prisoners at once. That's a stupid idea. How many fools do that? Oh, another gold delivery. Hello. Oh, and Duffy, Duffy, hold on a second. We're almost, we're almost ready to start the episode. Bear with me here. 2,879 in total. Uh, let me do some quick math. So it's 0 0.015 honor per piece of gold. That puts us at roughly 421.185 pieces of honor for Anne, which puts us... Well, not a second. That puts us very close to a... I seem to have turned into a children's, children's dog puppet. I... I Puts us nowhere near still. Fucking hell. Oscar. Even using vanilla outposts expanded. Vanilla expanded outposts. And, I mean, let's I'll say what it is. Effectively cheating. <laughs> Even with effectively cheating. I'm going to be here for the rest of my human life. Unbelievable. Unbelievable work. And come on. Fuck off out my prison. 3.9 resistance. Oh, should I just execute the rest? Oh, we are the good guys. And, I mean, they are zombies. <laughs> Whoopsie. My finger keeps slipping, and I have no idea what's causing that. Oh, I'm just so clumsy, aren't I? Oh, there was a minor tremor in my part of the country. Maybe I've got a bit of a dusty trackball. 
Oh, make sure, make sure you gamers don't get a dusty trackball. Have a shower. Oh, no, Anne. Oh, this is so terrible. She just keeps slipping sword first into all these prisoners that I'm sick of seeing. How terrible. That one blew up and took up the whole outer wall. You can stay. Tell your friends. You know what? Release them. Tell your friends what you saw. <laughs> Cole? Wait, what? Who the hell was Cole? Were you the person I just released? Wait, who the fucking hell's Cole? No. Where did you come from? Oh, I'm not complaining. It's another person, isn't it? Go on. Go to my mining camp. Oh, sissy. <laughs> the facade is it's dropping. It's dropping further. Get it back. Can you just send prisoners? Oh, no. Don't tell me I was just able to send prisoners. Oh, no. Well, we'll try it. Oh, this could be horrible. We are with the, the good guys. We're the good guys. We're not the good guys. We're the good guys. And I'm just wondering if it's more morally acceptable and morally good to execute zombies or make the zombies contribute to a better society. So maybe I should have just sent the prisoners out there to get and more gold. I mean, shit, if this is the amount of gold they're sending us, imagine how much gold they've got at their base. They're probably living in solid gold houses. They probably eat, breathe, and shit gold. So being a Twitch streamer as you sit there and eat cereal as a children's TV show plays in the background. Ah, what a life that would be. Huh. Huh. Would you look at that? Really does make you think, doesn't it? Devon. 1,300 gold in six more days. Go. Go send them. Uh, how long are we going to wait for the tray caravan? We might not even live that long. I said that yesterday, and then uh, we basically got a game over, and then time reversed. Crazy how that happens. To be fair, that was total bullshit, and everybody agreed. Ooh, and while I was prepping... Pre pre <laughs> while I was prepping for today's episode, uh, I had them... Oh, for God's sake, I had them extract more genes. I said they got a 50% chance of giving us a gene that we want, but I lied because they've got germline genes too. Brilliant. Okay. Uh, what about what about Oscar? I presume you didn't give me anything useful. No. No, and you never probably will. But we've rebuilt, more or less. What does that have to do in the colony? What does that have to do in the world? Everybody's got titles. Oh, let me put the titles back. Every single person has a title besides dead lived. <laughs> no, please, by all means, keep crafting. You're like the ultimate all-rounder character. And wept, for there were no more prisoners to take. This is it. We're just here. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. Well, I'll see you all in the next hour. Oh, my God. It's bugged again. They didn't send They didn't send everybody they needed. Oh, what if I just punch the shuttle? Will that break the quest? I'm going to go punch the shuttle. Is that going to upset the Empire? Yeah, no, don't do that. <laughs> oh, my God. You can add prisoners. I just mass murdered a load of zombies. I mean, to be fair, they were already dead, so it was not a big deal. Oh, God. Now none of the bestowing quests are working. It's not timing out. God, that Twitch tutorial is really looking good right now. Kids, you want to see a picture of my feet? <laughs> oh, shit. I hate this game. Oh, obviously, when I said, hey, kids, I meant like grown ass adults. I, I mean, I don't think it's technically illegal to show a kid your feet, but that's like, it's like a bit weird. I wouldn't do it. Some of you in the comments might. I certainly wouldn't. Of oh, what the f fuck is that sword doing there? <laughs> you mean Tart requires bedroom? Bazroto, I just, you have a bedroom. It's there. It's Bazroto and Toongi's bedroom. Wait, Bazroto and Toongi's bedroom? They're not in a relationship. What? Oh, he's got death row skulls getting it. Oh, dear. Okay, well, I've got the solution to this problem. You ready? This is up for 7,000 hours solution to this problem. Oi, deadlift? Get the fuck out of Baz Roto's bed, you little prick. Got some of you to deadlift. Why don't you deadlift these nuts? Take the gamble. Just take the gamble. Just, I can't wait. I cannot wait anymore. I can't wait. I can't wait anymore. Put him in the casket. No, not the casket. What, uh, extractor. It's kind of a casket, really. I mean, it will be. Because he's going to die. <laughs> <laughs> Get the fucking gas! Where's the button? Oh, I can't. I can't deal with this today. It's taking my life force away. I'm taking my life force away. Bow woman, thank you. Somebody of substance. Oh, I just clenched my fist so hard, I think I broke my finger. Oh my god, that really hurts. No, not my clicking hand. Oh, I launched Tomboy off to go buy me some stuff years ago and forgot about her. Um. <laughs> 
<laughs> How you doing, Tomboy? You having a good time? What I need uh, is plasteel, steel, anything other than gold. If I see any more gold, I'm probably going to have to scream like a banshee. Steel. No, I need plasteel. You don't understand. Oh, I need pla I need plasteel. I'll take cloth as well if you've got that. Oh, they don't even have cloth. Here, take some of Aunt's components. Give me the silver. I'll just stop pilot. I'll just stop pilot and I'll be happy with my silver and my Oh <laughs> Stench. You little jump scare are you. I was gonna zoom in and say something about Stench about how I hate him or something like that, but then I was like, nah. I don't need to. They're not real. It's all in my mind. Some dickhead, when they were setting up the scenario, called this city Lakeside Port, when clearly that's the fucking ocean. This give anyone else, like, existential dread, like looking at the back of the planet. Just like an ocean so massive it covers half the world. It kind of gives me the little, little creepies. Gives me the little creepies. I think my version of hell is playing some Nautica. Just, just ever. Or, like, hard work. Now I can't react to children's cartoons on Twitch while eating my cereal. I don't know if that actually happened. I know that that happened. I just don't want to make any enemies. You get the streamer mafia after you. You don't want. You don't need that sort of evil in your life. You don't need that evil. They they are. They, they won't stop. They'll find you. Are you allowed to trade with the Empire after I kick their shuttle, or is this like it? Oh no, they're fine. They're fine. That's good. That's good news, isn't it? <laughs> Am I done then? Is that it? But sort of Baron ceremony. So they, uh, uh, surely it'll just expire naturally at some point, right? Let's take it out of the bin. If you miss or fail this ceremony, it's been 1.6 days. Oh, it's been 1.6 entire days. Oh, whoa, 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 don't lose that. My God. Abra piss off. All right, there you go. We're done. Everybody's happy now. Let's carry on with our, uh, oh, we failed it. That's so crazy. I can't believe that happened. Sorry, can you actually turn up with the right people this time? Uh, I thought my colony was incompetent, but the Empire really are giving me a run for their money, huh? You know, so I said a run for their money, because it's... I'm just trying to give them gold. That was very clever. <laughs> hey, where's the quest, though? Ooh, a mech scourge. No, you're okay. Yeah, but, like, where's the bestower? Oh, my God, have they done it again? I'm actually... Which I presume is the noise the spaceship made when it landed. Oh, fuck off. Why are they doing this? Is because we're not friends? What do you mean? Oscar's Oscarski What just bring him just br it's not like you should just be more patient and not take off before the people are in the fucking shuttle Okay, here's what I'm gonna do is my deal. I'm gonna Reboot the game if it doesn't work. I'm nuking the Empire. That's it. That's it. That's my goal Ooh, This is the moment that will separate the Empire from the ashes or turn the Empire into ashes if they <laughs> don't turn up. Lilu's Praetor Ceremony. Ah! Oh, they actually bought everybody this time. Where the friggin' hell are you going? What? And they've walked off the map. <laughs> they've flown away. <laughs> This is just about the strangest bug I've ever seen in my whole life. Um, I guess that's the end then. We can't get to Archduchess because the bestowers don't turn up anymore. They're just like, no, I'm good. I'm done. Emperor of Royal Bestower. They still are in the game though. Look, they're like right there. I can see you. I can see you. So why just like turn up in the quest though? Like, what do you do? Oh, just like, just like appear. Just like come and join me in the quest and then piss off. How about that? Okay. Okay. And it's just not dropping off any bestowers. It's dropping off people, and then the ship is just flying away. Oh, come on. From stench, we got red eyes. Brilliant. I think I think now is where we give up. <laughs> oh then. Oh, and you changed your hair. That looks lovely. Um until further notice, this series is cancelled. That's the end. That's it. I mean, I can't do anything about this. Annoyingly, I have to pre-record a load of content because I'm not going to be here for like two days. So I was like, oh, it's fine. I'll just record two rumbles in a row. It's not a big deal. I don't do it very often. And then you do this shit to me. So you've just like ruined my real life now. Uh, so I'm done. That's it. I'm not going to let this game ruin my life any further. I'm out. Fuck you. D take your prayer to ceremony and shove it up your anus. Why did he just do the bestower ceremony? Is he stupid or something? All right, then I'll give you something for this episode because it's been a total shit heap. Uh, Haunts mod coming soon, TM. Stay tuned. I'll base it when, whenever, whenever it's finished, whenever we're getting around to finish it.
it'll be done. Lots of features. We're still working out, going back and forth, sorting stuff. I've added a couple more in the last couple of days. You'll see them. And there'll also be generic ghosts too, if you're like, oh, I really love the idea of people being haunted from whatever things they do to get them. But uh, I don't like the idea of them being from my favorite YouTuber series. Hey, get rid of that man. Get rid of my man. No, don't you step in here. Do you know what happens to rodents who step in this throne room? I know rabbit's not a rodent. Okay, you don't have to explain that to me. Thank you. With generic ghosts, and I even said I'll do some JoJo ones at some point. They can enable JoJo mode for stands, because that's what it is. Legally distinct, of course. We're done. Thanks for watching. I, I just don't know what... I, it's fucking 3 a.m. I got a life to live here. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> what an anti-climax. <laughs> 28,000 gold. <gasps> we could build a golden pyramid. Fuck the empire. Oh, and right, just like that, you pulled me right back in. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes, fine sleigh towels and carpets do look nice, but you know what would look slightly nicer? Oh, 61,000 gold. What if... They flew off. What if uh, we just wait for the trader to turn up? I don't know how long that'll be, to be fair. We could just wait for the trader to turn up, and I could just give them all of Anne's gold in one go. Because I've been told by a somewhat reliable source, if not frightening fella, uh, that apparently the final quest is a little bit different to a standard bestowing ceremony. So maybe we could just bypass the bestowing crap altogether. But we would need a shitload more gold. How am I going to do that these days? But this is at the start of the series, right? But the only the only infinite resource that I allowed us this time was from the outpost. Because about building an empire. No deep drills. No grand penetrating scanners. No quarries. No growable resources. Blah, 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 blah. Nothing like that. You can do trading, sure. Because that encourages you to go out there and to build your empire a little bit. And build outposts. That was it. That has just officially been revoked. Give me some grand penetrating scanners. I'm going to show you some fierce drilling. <laughs> I can't say that. I've already said I'm going to show pictures of my feet to people. Ah, <sighs> oh, fuck. We could just hang out. Yeah, you know, we could just be like, we could just be like friends hanging out for a while. I put up a fun music mashup on the second channel because my professional channel was deleted because I was genuinely too sexual for YouTube. They said that uh, my content was intended to sexually gratify the audience, so they deleted my whole channel, and now I can't make new channels, which is fun. Um, so yeah, actually too sexy for YouTube. Anyway, I put it up on my second channel. Uh, I hope you like that. It's um, a mashup of Biggie Smalls and some 41. And that's kind of all I've done with my day, really. <laughs> that's enough about me. How about you? What have you been doing, huh? We haven't got any steel. Ah. Uh... Just build out of fucking gold. Just build, put the gold in the drill. Good joke. Yeah, good joke. Tell another. Grand pyr... Pyr... Yeah, good joke. Pyr pyramid. Am I, how, how the hell do you spell pyramid? Am I spelling it on P-Y? Great pyramid, not grand pyramid. Ooh. Oh, it's 75,000 gold. Maybe we've got a new... <laughs> a new goal. <laughs> oh, would you look at that kind of crazy timing? A trade caravan from the Empire has arrived. The tribute collector. Oh, two of them have arrived. Well, that's good. When I want them to actually send people, they don't send enough. And then when I ask them to send people, they send too many. That's just... That's just really good. Um, hey, you want some stuff, though? Uh, trade. No, no, no. I don't want to trade. I want to give you... Tribute collector. Yes. Oh, you know what? You can take that shithead back. Yeah, take this. Take that. Four, two, three. Is it enough? No. And is now despot. And I am desperate. <laughs> it's not even much of a joke, is it? It's just, it's just actually true right now. Hey, what do we need? What do we need? What do we need? Console. Despot. Stellark. High Stellark. Or oh, actually not that far off. Oh my god. Well, should we see if it works? I'm happy to give it a go. I think I'm going to be disappointed. Oh, we've got to build more stuff. Hey, I love building stuff. That's fine. Um, room impressiveness. We're basically done. We need Candelabra, Imperial Banner, Small Stealer, Imperial Slab, and Small Imperial Slab. Where am I going to put all this shit, huh? You kids like books? You want to buy some books, though? Yeah, take some books. Oh, we've got a, we've got a sale right now. Buy one, get... 25 free. It's very generous of us. You're very generous indeed. You're very welcome to that. Have you got anything good, though? Have you got any gold? Have you got any gold? I need to give it to your mate. All right, whatever. Go on. Go on, piss off. Imperial banner. There you go. Let's slap some of those bad boys down right next to the brazier. That one needs to go over a bit. Right next to the brazier. That looks lovely. Can we rotate them? Nope. 
We're not allowed. I'm going to put one there and one there. That'll look good. Small steely and imperial slabs and imperial sculptures. Steel it. Oh, why would I need this much stuff? Where am I supposed to put it all? It looks like a fucking charity shop in here. My god, what a bunch of junk. Imperial slab. We'll slap them behind the dining room table. Okay, is that it? Is that all we need? Steelies, banners, candle, arbors. I assume, I have a great joke. I assume the room impressiveness will probably go up from this garbage that we're throwing in here. Small imperial sculpture. How do how do I how do I do that though? We'll just like oh just like make a sculpture. Like a just like a sculpture though. Small imperial sculpture. Hey, would you look at that? Man, if only I had more slate that I wasn't wasting on a thousand skeletons. You're gonna make them out of blood creep, though. That's kinda cool. Okay, okay, I'm in. Mona's Countess Ceremony, huh? <laughs> I fucking hate this game. I don't know why it's suddenly broken. It's very coincidental timing as well, isn't it? Almost suspicious, one would say. Damn, you know what? I kinda want him back. Can I buy, can I buy that back? Can I take him back, though? I'll trade Juana for him back. Oh, damn it. Fuck it. You know what? Someone's, someone's got to teach this guy a lesson, haven't they? <laughs> They're going to be angry at me for that. <laughs> no, hang on. They're fine. They're just angry at the ship and Anne fell over because she... Why are you angry at the ship? What are you doing? What the fuck is happening in this game? Um, Anne fell over because she used a power. I thought they'd shot her dead, but no, they haven't. They've just decided to smash my ship up as a lesson. You kill our cat, we'll beat your spaceship. <laughs> You can be there a long time. <laughs> I should do a masterclass on how to break this game. Step one, be be busy the next day and have to record in advance. That's pretty much it. That's pretty much all there is to it. Because then God will strike you down. Leave my fucking ship alone. Tomboy, just fly away. Just close your eyes and walk away. My God. Okay, yeah, okay, I get it. You're angry at me. Whatever. I killed your weird cat boy. Okay, don't butcher him. I want the body. Not for anything nefarious. Well, no, for things nefarious, but not like, you know... Not like, not like that, you get me? To be clear, you can't even begin to understand the frustration that comes with watching people not bother watching the rest of the series. Because uh, it effectively is just another grind fest, right? Uh, and then uh, ultimately it coming to a complete standstill after fighting through it. Because you're like, oh, well, whatever, you know, I'll just, I'll just, I'll just do it. Because it'll be kind of fun to tick that off and say that I've done it. And then it not fucking work. I don't blame anyone. I'm not that type of person. I mean, it's just it's just a game, ultimately. It is just tremendously frustrating when arbitrary bullshit like this happens. I've already checked. I've already checked. No mods have updated between today and the last time I played this. So it's just it's just suddenly like something's gone wrong in the save, and that's it. That's all there is to it, you know? It's just one of those... One of those fu you know what? Just fucking eat him. Honestly, just fucking eat him. I just want to see him eaten. I just want to see him eaten. Slurp him down right now. End of Evangelion. Done. Gets fucking slurped. Is that the limited edition Oscar bathwater? Wow. Oh, God, no. You don't know what it'll do to you. Oh, no. Oh, no. Bulky, you don't need that kind of evil. God, do you know how many Reddit threads you're going to get made about you now? Oh, no. Need some steel, though. So I'm just going to, like, what do I need? 150 steel? Just, like, take this shitting thing apart? That'll do it. That's actually, like, exactly what I need. I should go take that apart. We put that into the deep drill. The thing that I said I wasn't actually really going to use because, like, didn't really want there to be any infinite resources, and yet the game has decided to change the deal, so I'm going to alter it a little myself, if that's okay. Okay, I would like steel. <gasps> we could go for diamond pyramid. Don't start another project, not when you're basically burning all of this down in the first place. G ground penetrating scanner, right? And then watch this. We take we take our best, smartest researchers, we say a Volker, and then eventually we'll get three of the bloody things. We'll get everybody scanning. I'll have every resource I could ever need. Who's good at drilling these days? Like, nobody, because Bazroto gave up. Slippery. Well, actually, I'm good with it. Slippery, you're on drill duty. Congratulations. Oh, my God. You've already found some. Why? How has that happened? Holy shit, though. User scanning speed, uh, 481%. We just got very lucky with the with the random find interval. Because, look, that's not exactly going that fast. We just got hyper lucky. Where is it? If you spawn in a stupid place, I'm going to be... Oh. Oh, right in Anne's throne room. Great. Me? Bitter about something? You must be terribly confused. How kind of candelabra is that? What do, you, what do you think the candle bit in the... Oh, why are we lucky in the mountain? What, what do you think the candle bit comes from, huh? That's a light bulb. You know what we call this? We call this a fucking lamp. Bone lamp. Don't bone lamp. Not unless you've turned it off first. Lepre, how would you like to not be chef anymore? Because we've got a better chef, and that better chef's name is Deadlift. 
Because he's, he's called that because he's lifting the entire colony on his back. Um, how do you like some drill arms? <laughs> Asking for a friend. A desperate, desperate, frightened friend. Fucking squirrels. Consuming red roses. Really? You sniff those out? A man of your... Where the fuck? <laughs> what kind of circuitous route was that, you weird little prick? You want, you want drill arms? Hey, you want drill arms though? I promise I'll I promise I'll get, get you set up. I got the good shit, you know? I got them drill arms. Oh, we actually do have drill arms. Hang on. Let's just have a look. Like like arm, drill arm, like limb, limb, drill arm, power claw. Ah, whatever. Take the drill arms. Drill arms do drill better, or don't they? It's probably a better question. Or whatever I just said um, that means things. Um, deep drill speed, it does. It does. 7,000 hours. Oh, I can't keep track. Every other series is a different bionics mod, because like one comes out every 30 minutes, so it's kind of hard to keep track of what the hell's going on anymore. Missing 60 steel. I am. I'm missing more than 60 steel, trust me. The irony is the mod pack hasn't run this fast in months. It hasn't run this fast literally since like episode 5. And everything's broken. It's better than ever and everything is broken. Hey, you wanna know what's a stupid mechanic? I can't give her a second drill arm because her arm's cut off at the shoulder and the drill arm doesn't go all the way up to the shoulder. It's only from the elbow down. Uh, so that's good. <laughs> yeah, you can have a slightly fancier bionic arm to, uh, you know, make up for the fact that I just chopped off your other bionic arm. Fine, fine. Okay, calm down a little bit. We're up to plus 100 opinion with the Shattered Empire now. Are we like friends? We're like good. We're not enemies anymore. There you go. We're all, we're, everybody's fine. Um, but I'm not going to completely burn all this all this stuff quite yet because there's still there's still possibly a chance that Imperial Trader would turn up, right? And we could just give them, give them the rest of the stuff and still do the quest without any problems. In theory, I'm going to put an ultimatum out there for Rim Rim. I'm going to threaten the game right now. If we can't, if, if I can't find a way to fix it before this time tomorrow, bef before standard episode release time tomorrow, that's it. We're over. We're done. I'm, I'm cutting our losses. I think what I will do is I'll just say at that point, let's cut our losses. Let's move on. Let's just fire the quest, the final quest, and just see what happens. At least give an end to the story, because that's, that's really what I'm here for at this stage. I'd say the quest manually or something like that. You know, we'll find, I'll find a creative way to weave that in. There's, there's no problems there. I wanted to do it legit. I really did. But again, you've seen what happens. So I'm not going to, I'm not going to go butt wild. I'm not going to spend it on a pyramid as much as it pains me in my heart. Uh, we're just going to be kind of good and patient and kind. <sighs> and I'm just going to seethe quietly. What? What? I mean, what are you doing though? What are you doing? We've got petting zoo. Honestly, that's fine. It's 4 a.m. I've wasted too much time on this today. I've already tried fixing it in the past. Uh, like, it just took like an hour trying to fix it. It didn't work. Probably just set like uh, the penultimate rank manually, the Stellark rank. We'll make sure we got the throne room. You know, we'll set ourselves up a challenge here. We'll build the final throne room, the final bedroom. Make sure everything is uh, spick and span. Make sure it's all tidy and good and nice. You're not the silly. You're not the silly people. I'm the silly person. Like. 95% of the time, but this is one of those situations where clearly it was just a countdown to us winning. So the game breaking has really thrown a spanner in the works, but it's just stopped the inevitable. So I'm happy just to like say, okay, we, we were going to get it right. Let's just at least finish off the story. That's all good. Uh, have you got anything that you'd like to see before I completely wrap things up? Probably tomorrow, to be honest. I think I'd, it's just about worn my patience thin with this. Then I'm all ears. Other than that, I think we're probably out. Have pre-planned the ending. Of course, there's a greater Rim Rim story to pay attention to. The cinematic universe, if you will. So there is a, a final thing that, that regardless of, of whether or not I'm able to fix the bug, will still be happening. Thank you for your patience. Thank you for being with me. Thank you for holding my hand throughout this fucking mess. Thank you, as always, of course, for watching. Thank you for being here during this difficult time. Next series, we're going to have our catharsis. A catharsis series. But this time, it'll probably be actually catharsis, because I don't think any series has tested my blood pressure as much as this one. Thank you, of course, to the long-suffering patrons, some of which have been long-suffering as long as me. So, a real big thank you to all of you. Thank you to The Link King, Jonathan Cameron, John Viral, Chris, Dwomutsik, uh, Lord Snarky, Under the Couch, Lithobreaker, Vonorath, Assault Fox, Johnny Wood, Christina, Mask of Loki, Cow Aladdin, V Frostbane, Sunrunner 37, VC, Brain Chief, Werewolf, Camline, Helixian, Eight, El Scorchio 82, and Blizzard 4337 for their support today. The executive producer stays over on Patreon. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Big Patreon video coming soon. Lots to talk about, the usual stuff, more or less, but kind of plans and 
upcoming series changes. Again, it was going to be Generations 2, but due to some uh, things that are happening that I can't discuss because it's not my place to discuss it, those are being put on uh, a delay temporarily. It's good news. It's good things happening. So just stay tuned. Trust me, you'll be glad we're delaying it. Thank you to Pumbly, Skylar Drake, Aragon Awesome, Zubot the Chaotic, Jizzleson, Thomas DeSantis, Elliptic, Daggett, Zen Master, Joseph Keen, Wolfie, Flabba Wabba Babba, Jabba Noonga, Thorn Midwinter, Rad Nebula, Sam Kears, Trash Panda, Paladin, Armor, Audrey, Hershenson, Thomas Holt, and Massey. God, this is wiped me out today.